All right, so in this video, we are going to integrate the payment gateways. Okay, so I'm gonna click on add payment, right? And let's uh, say I wanna connect Razorpay. Okay, so it's gonna ask me for the key ID and the key secret. Again, it's the uh, same, uh, you know, same thing. I am inside my Razorpay account. I need to go inside the settings. And over here, if you will see, I need to select the API keys, right? API keys and generate a live key. So I've got the key ID. All right. Let's come back and put the key ID over here and a key secret. Let's come back and put the key secret over here. All right. And click on save. And you know, this is done at the same time. Uh, let's connect InstaMojo. So again, settings, I want to select private API key, right? So inside InstaMojo, we will have the option of API and plugins. So this is the private API key. All right. And the authorization token, right? Now this is very important that you put the right uh, key and the right, uh, you know, authorization token in InstaMojo or whether in Razorpay, because you know, only on the basis of that, your payments are going to pass, right? So you click on save. Now the thing is that, you know, you can put anything over here. It will still show connected, but if you have entered wrong details, then automatically the payment won't be caught ever, right? So ultimately you need to put the right credentials. So make sure that you are copying and pasting it yeah, right. And, uh, yeah, I mean, that's it. Right. And, uh, I mean, after you have tested it, you make sure that you do a test payment to see whether it is connected or not, right? So uh, how to create products and how to do payments, that is something that I'm gonna cover in the product tutorials. So you can see over there, but make sure whenever you connect uh, your autoresponder, you do a test payment and see, right? So yeah, this is it for this video. I'm gonna see you in the